With the improvement of Tesla's self-driving technology and battery lifetime, it's safe to say that Tesla's robotaxi network will eventually roll out, whether it be in one year or 10 years. However, while the idea sounds fantastic, there is still one major issue. How will the robotaxi charge if there is no human operating the vehicle? In this video, I'm going to discuss why I believe Tesla will soon ramp up a supercharging network that will be self-charging. Before I begin, please hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. It really helps out with the channel. With that being said, let's get right into it. Tesla is famous for its unconventional features, including the sentry mode, body mode, and gaming system. A self-charging supercharger may seem like an absurd idea for an automaker like Ford or GM, but for Tesla, it's something they've been planning to do for quite a while. Take a look at a video Tesla released four years ago, where the automaker developed a prototype of a self-charging supercharger. One of the key factors in Tesla's batteries is the time it takes for a vehicle to charge at a supercharger. The ultimate goal for Tesla is to allow supercharging networks to be as quick or even quicker than a gas station. By removing the need for the driver to get out of their car and plug in a supercharger to their Tesla, this would decrease the time it takes for Teslas to charge and therefore make electric vehicles look like a more attractive option compared to the internal combustion engine. Elon Musk has previously made it very clear that he would like to make the charging time of Teslas faster than gasoline vehicles. We, we filmed the gas station. The gas station is on the big screen and there's the, there's the battery pack getting swapped out with some festive lights. Another reason why I believe self-charging superchargers are coming soon is because of the health issue that YouTube continues to censor. In the age of the current pandemic, cleanliness is very important to the majority of the population. This also applies to superchargers, as once the economy reopens and people begin to travel, it only makes sense to not have people transmit the virus when charging their vehicles. To top it off, Tesla's supercharger hasn't been updated since March of 2019, so it's safe to say that Tesla will soon unveil its V4 supercharger. As humans, we all enjoy passive income. There's nothing better than making money without putting in extra work. If Tesla was to roll out its self-charging network, then the only barrier would be the initial cost of rolling out the network. Once this network is fully set up, the expenses of these networks would only come down to the cost of electricity and repairs. As of now, the only question is whether Tesla will be willing to spend the extra money on self-charging vehicles. Eventually, since Tesla would like to roll out its robo-taxi network, the company must release a self-charging supercharger. The only question is when Tesla will begin to ramp up the self-charging charger. The technology for self-charging vehicles is already here, as even a Dutch startup was able to create a self-charging charger. Let me know what you think about Tesla's self-charging supercharger in the comment section below. Go check out the link in the description below to get two free stocks from Webull. Also, please hit the like button and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. I appreciate your support. 